hey guys welcome back to my channel today i have a lot going on actually this whole week i have a steamy pulled pork in the slow cooker i got to do some packing and prepping it is tuesday but we are heading to the lake on thursday with my brother-in-law and sister-in-law and it's gonna be really really fun just to have a relaxing weekend it's probably gonna be a little bit chilly but it's just gonna be nice to cozy up inside the cabin. So I'm really looking forward to that. I just have a lot to get done before that happens. Pulled pork is done. I just put it in a plate to cool down. And I got a huge mess going on. <laughs> so I'm just trying to get my head wrapped around everything I need to bring for food. I'm just like in such a good mood. But I honestly, I don't know if it's just a fluke from one day but today's the first day I took my ashwagandha um, my herb for my cortisol I'm actually feeling really really good my natural path said that it probably won't take long before you'll notice the difference it'll kick in pretty fast but it's only been a day so I don't know am I just overthinking things I have no idea but it's amazing and I hope it works part of me thinks that my thyroid is a little bit off and it needs some support because of my high stress but my body just like it feels I don't know maybe it's just because I haven't been out and about running around the last two days because that makes a huge difference in my energy levels I'm usually on the couch for the next few days but I am really really pumped I just got done my workout it is a Thursday We're heading to the lake today really not sure why I'm so rashy yikes it was only chilly for like two days this week and I'm already, you can't even see, I'm already like bleeding because my skin is so dry. Yikes. I'm almost all ready to go, packed up, just gotta do some dishes, but I'm in so much pain. I'm trying to be hopeful. I want to be able to spend the weekend present. I want to be present in the moment. And I don't want to be focusing on trying to feel better and I don't know, it's just really sad. I'm so nauseous and I'm just in so much pain and it's been all day, actually it's every day. And my lips are so chapped that they're burning, so I should put on some lip balm. Hoping to enjoy this weekend though, I'm really, really looking forward to it, so I hope that I can fully, fully enjoy it. We are finally heading out. We just got some gas and picked up a few things at our grocery store. And we're finally leaving. My stomach is in a lot of pain, so hopefully I can get over that. We just got here. It's already dark. It's like not even seven yet. Days are so short, it's kind of sad. Now to pack everything up. <laughs> Oliver, what does the snake say? Ow. Oh, are you okay? Oliver, what does the cow say? <laughs> we just got done hot tubbing and I'm laying on the bed because I too tired to change. Isn't changing out of a wet bathing suit so much work? Or is it just me? Good morning. I just got up. This cabin is lakefront, so I'm seriously just staring right at the lake. It's even more beautiful from the back. <laughs> Come here. Somebody wanted to play upstairs while mom and dad and uncle finish their puzzle. Well, thank you. What are we doing? Are gonna play? Oh. He sees himself and he's very intrigued. Where's your bus? Where's your bus? Say hi. 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 Yes. Oh, do you watch Auntie drink lots of water?
you have my water bottle, then can I have your bus? Can I have your bus? Where are you going? Careful. Run, run, run. Go. Okay, let's go. It's not even quite 10 o'clock and I'm ready for bed. Kenzie's other brother just showed up, so I think the guys are gonna go hot tubbing, eat, I don't know, play games. And my sister-in-law is sleeping too. We really didn't have much plan today. Relaxed. We went to a local store because I forgot my toothbrush. So I had to go pick one up. I'm exhausted, I just don't feel good. Good morning, it is now like eight o'clock. Just woke up, slept in a lot later today, which was nice. It sounds like everyone is downstairs already having breakfast, so I'm gonna go meet up with them. There's no agenda today, but it looks like there's sun out today and I'm so excited. It was so cold and gloomy, we didn't even go out. So if it gets nice, I'd like to spend some time outside today. But we'll see. Move it. Sleeping. They are outside hot tubbing. He was really terrified at first, but now he just loves it outside. It's so cute. He's splashing the gentlest splash I've ever seen a child do. But I'm hoping to go for a walk yet. Just gonna rest for a bit. Got a major non-stop headache. Oh, this pimple. It was one of those painful ones that you couldn't really pop and I still tried to pop it and then it got all red and inflamed. Yep, super fun. I know I'm not like filming a whole lot, but there's not really much to film and I don't want to invade too much of their privacy. So please excuse my random clips. Are we going for a walk and watching the boys for rocks in the lake? <laughs> <laughs> going for a walk, Ollie? Oh, look at those boogies. Look at those boogies. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> tomorrow so just trying to enjoy it as much as we can now. The trees look really beautiful. It's not showing in the video. <laughs> Your face is cut off. Surprised you're still out here. Yeah, it's actually not too bad. It's I usually pretty wear. chilly. My hands are cold. I love this. It's a little bit more reach. <laughs> he uses me for my hugs. He gets me to squeeze the back so that he can stretch out. <laughs> Now? Yeah. I have no idea if you guys can hear anything. It's kind of windy. Actually, it's really windy. I just kind of went for a stroll. My hands actually are pretty cold. It's but I just kind of been cooped up in the house, and usually I work outside and just tend to be outside quite often, regardless of the weather. So I just kind of wanted some fresh air just to get out a little bit. And I did bundle up. I got like three sweaters. My hair is a mess. But it's very beautiful. No, that is not snow, it's just like foam. <laughs> There's just cabins all along the beach. Everyone took out their docks for the year. Because you can't really enjoy it. But it's so beautiful here. I just feel really crummy. 
I've just had to lay down so many times with migraine. So I'm just at the point where like I'm okay at this second. Look at the trees. Oh, it's beautiful. If there's anybody in their cabins, they're probably wondering what this chick is doing. Wandering around the beach when it's cold outside with the camera and talking to it. <laughs> but anyways, we're just gonna make some supper, watch a movie, and then tomorrow morning we're leaving, so we gotta clean up and just do a few minute last things. A few last minute things. Jeepers, English Danny. <laughs> You guys, Kent is gonna be annoyed with me. Wow, foggy camera. I made them go to the local store to get me a toothbrush yesterday because I forgot mine. Nope, didn't forget it. Just put it in my bag and not in my hygiene bag. Whoops, sorry babe. You guys, my skin is still so terrible. I don't know what is going on. We are back home doing so many loads of laundry. You can probably hear in the back. I did not get much sleep at all last night. We woke up early, Ken's and I went hot tubbing. That was really nice. And then we cleaned the cabin and left. And dealing with this silly migraine is just challenging. Luckily, it is not as bad as it can be. And it definitely comes in waves. But I'm just exhausted from cleaning and doing all this laundry. And I still have so much more to go. And I know those clips were kind of um, jumbled. I just kind of filmed random stuff that we did, but I hope it was still enjoyable. We didn't do a whole lot, so it's just the way it goes. But I'm gonna end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Got hair in my mouth. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.